Welcome to your daily message from our Divine Compassionate Guides. As always, thank you so much for joining me. Please, if you have not, please like, share, and subscribe to stay up to date with our message. And as always, I really hope today's message will help heal and serve you in the most divine way. Today, we're pulling from the Work Your Light Oracle Cards by Rebecca Campbell. So with these cards, they do have um, different suits. So we'll find out what the suit is and then, of course, what our message is for today. So let's jump right in here. Ooh, protection. Call back your power. Cut the cords. Soul retrieval. So as I always recommend, just take that first moment to get yourself centered. Take that deep breath in. And then as you exhale, become open and open and aware so we can learn about the card and how it affects you today. So this is an activation card. So these type of card activate the energies and healing within the person that we're reading. So that'll be everybody that's listening to it as well as who we're reading for. And they are about activating who we are at a soul level. Soul contracts have been made in past lives. Soul gifts that you have developed, past life experiences gained over lifetimes, soul agreements, vows taken, things rising to be healed, and qualities that are ready to be remembered and activated from within. These cards have an activation invocation that we will read at the end. So this is definitely going to be about connecting us to activating and con activating. Like that's what we've been, we've been getting the message, to connect to source consciousness, to open our minds to connect and this is going to help us activate i really feel but let's jump into the protection message let's see how this applies to us today call back your power cut the cords soul retrieval you are being called to protect your energy and call back your power may all the lost pieces return home now take a look at who and what drains your energy do not keep your tabs open shut down energetically each night Energetic cords are formed between people, places, objects, and events, so it's important to keep checking in. Your energy and energetic space are sacred, so treat them as such. Keeping your energy clear takes work. As we go through life, we can give away our power, so it is important that we call it back by cutting energetic cords or doing a form of healing known as soul retrieval. Can you think of a traumatic event, relationship, or soul memory that you are being called to call back your power from? Check into your body now and see which chakras feels like it needs a bit of energetic cleanup. So it's advising you to sit, take a moment, and just notice how the energy flows. You can take that moment, you can turn inwardly, maybe thinking of the energy from the top, the crown of the head, or from the root chakra. So you've got, if you're coming from the root, then up through the sacral, which is, you know, the, the root, and then the sacral, which is just below the belly button an inch or so. Then you've got the solar plexus, which is ab above the belly button, a little bit over an inch. Then you've got the heart center, which is right in your heart, the heart chakra. The throat center, which is your throat chakra. And then the third eye, right there for that third eye. And then, of course, the crown of your head for the crown chakra. So it, it's recommending that you take a moment, scan those areas, and see if there is anything being held in any of those areas. And it's time to clean that up. And our work our light activation. I call back any lost soul fragments, power or light now, any vows, soul contracts, hexes or programs from the past or present from this life or others that are not in the highest good of all. I relinquish now any power or light that I have willingly or unwillingly given away or had taken from me. I call back now any cords or attachments from this life or others. I release now for the highest good of all. And so it is, and so it is, and so it is. I'll repeat that again. I call back any lost soul fragments, power or light now, any vows, soul contracts, hexes or programs from the past or present, from this life or others that are not in the highest good of all. I relinquish now any power or light that I have willing or unwillingly given away or take or had taken from me. I call back now 
any cords or attachments from this life or others. I release now for the highest good of all. And so it is, and so it is, and so it is. This is our time. Just like we had pulled, I think it was actually yesterday, about how it's letting go, healing from those things so we can open up and completely connect to get, so we can be these manifesting cre creators. So we are being, we need to come back to that protection. We're going to call back our power and we're going to cut cords with anything that is not of our highest good. As always, I hope this message will help. And until tomorrow, namaste.